What's going on, everybody? Welcome to Trading Crypto. Today we're over Quant QNT, which is up 3.9% at $144.83. We finally broke out of our lifelong downtrend, man. Quant was the new stablecoin. I mean, we had Quant. We still do have Quant. I was debating on getting rid of it, man, because it was just bouncing around that $100, $110 range for so long. But we finally broke out. And we're actually going to go over that in the TA today, man. I'm so glad that I diamond hand because now now the sky is the limit for quant so with that let's get into the price prediction and technical analysis on qnt all right all right qnt this is what we're talking about right here guys ladies and gentlemen ladies and gentlemen look at that downtrend right there broken since 2021 multi-year downtrend has officially been broken if there's nothing you take take away from this video at least take that away you broke out of a multi-year downtrend which is extremely bullish for quant now we haven't came back down to test the multi-year resistance flip support yet. So that's something I'm still thinking is on the table. You know, that one final pullback to confirm the breakout. I mean, we don't technically need it. We don't technically need it, but majority of the time that's the case. I would say about 95% of the times that's the case. You come back down here to confirm it and then to infinity and beyond from there. But with that being said, if you draw from the all time top to the bottom, this was our main area of focus here. That 0.5 at 134, we smash through that. No stop no stop right there no breaks so what we're currently going to be contending with now is around that 150 160 range inevitably with that golden pocket sitting there at the 618 at 175 so 175 is the next main resistance area for quant on the lifelong fib now if we look at the short-term fib for quant which is this high to this low right here we're going to find some short-term resistance areas and as of right now you can see that short-term resistance area is that 618 which we did smack right into it around 153 to 155 so that is our area to observe right now for quant is trying to take over the 154 so we don't want to really focus on that long term uh fib but that is the main fib that we need to focus on once we start blowing up the short term fibs are very very important so 155 is our next resistance area we do have some room to run here on the macd nice engulfing candle today if we look at the rsi the rsi is also starting to tail up right here putting in hopefully a higher high i mean we haven't been overbought on quant in a very very long time and if we look at the wtx wtx is in the red and we have not printed a sell signal yet so there's a good possibility that we're gonna be running up back to that 154 155 range to try to overtake that resistance area and if that was the case and we did overtake that resistance area i would say strap in because we're to be on a ride after that point guys so quants looking bullish right now let's keep an eye on 155 if we get rejected from there we're coming back down to the 0.5 and then we can rally up from there but regardless we broke out of a multi-year downtrend congratulations we can finally start talking about some bullish movement for quant finally i'm excited boys so with that let's get for so with that none of this is financial advice and if there's any coins you'd like me to chart or if you just like to chat with me you can post them on any of my social media links all those links are below in the description